Now, earlier this year, Virgin Money Australia launched its new digital bank on the Temenos Banking Cloud. This enabled the Challenger brand to innovate, last, uh, innovate fast and differentiate with an ecosystem of partners. Now, to create a unique digital service that simplifies banking and rewards customers. The Temenos Banking Cloud makes it easier to launch new banking services, providing an agile platform that easily scales up and down depending on demand. With proven experience in delivering innovative technology and, success and successful banking solutions, Temenos has helped push boundaries for more than 70 challenger banks so far. Well, to look at these developments in more detail earlier, I spoke to Philip Finnegan, Managing Director for the Pacific Region of Temenos, and Greg Boyle, CEO of Virgin Money Australia. I, be I began by asking Philip how challengers can get a foothold in the Australian market. Absolutely. The market in Australia is dominated by the four major banks. But here at Temenos, we see real opportunities in developing unique retail propositions to customers. The industry is going through dramatic change. Uh, new technologies are lowering barriers to entry. Uh, we're seeing big tech, fintech, but challenger banks like Virgin Money are really providing some in interesting um, outcomes from, for retail customers. Right, right. And uh, coming over to yourself, Greg. Now, of course, there's a new digital banking license is happening and we're seeing a number of new fintech challengers in the Australian market. How is Virgin Money Australia different? Uh, so, like, what kind of problems are you actually solving for customers? Yeah, thanks. I mean, it, 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 customers have been really clear to us. They wanted something that was really simple and breaking down the complexity of financial services. We got a lot of feedback that they wanted a loyalty program that was different, not just something up front, but ongoing throughout their life. And and for us, they wanted something that was digital by design. They wanted to do mobile banking um, in, in, in the palm of their hands. And so we've delivered um, on that. And then um, you're right, there are a lot of fintech challenges um, in, the, in the market. Um, we're in a unique position. We've got this iconic global brand. We've got the backing of a 145-year-old bank uh, with Bank of Queensland, and we're combining that with uh, a leading technology player like um, Temenos, which is, is, is quite a powerful point of difference. And uh, coming over to yourself, Phil, no less than Richard Branson described Virgin Money Australia's new digital bank as the antithesis of a traditional bank, saying it embraces simplicity and rejects the notion of financial complexity. What does this actually mean in practice, and how does one bring simplicity to the fore? Yeah, absolutely. A fascinating quote. Um, it's really about providing that digital native experience. The, the ability to combine different offers and services directly in somebody's hand through their device. Uh, with uh, Temenos, Virgin Money has created frictionless, fully integrated digital banking experiences, bringing together the full range of retail capability from credit cards, transaction accounts, savings accounts and loyalty. Customers, most impressively, can create a new account in a few minutes on their phone and then start to save and transact without a delay. Indeed, indeed. Now, of course, as a digital bank, as you were saying, technology plays a crucial role. So staying with yourself, Phil, talk to us a bit about this partnership with Temenos. With our systems that we've provided and working in partnership with Virgin Money, we've provided a core banking platform that is open and that's really important for the value propositions that Virgin Money want to bring to market. So open APIs, all cloud native, cloud first has been a proposition, uh, supporting Greg and his team with their digital first proposition. Excellent. And let's get the other perspective on that. Greg, what say you on the partnership between uh, Virgin Money Australia and Temenos? What's your take? Yep, no, Phil, Phil spot on. We wanted to partner somewhat with someone who was a, a leading provider globally of core banking systems um, with an open open API framework. And, and that's critical for us because it means we can focus our investment where we can truly make a difference to the customer experience in the mobile app. Um, Terminos has delivered in spades on that. And, and in addition, through the integration framework and, and API um, infrastructure, we've already got over 30 technology partners and over 100 loyalty partners as part of our proposition. So um, the proof is in the pudding. And ultimately, that's all about um, delivering a great customer experience at a, at a lower cost to operate for us. Uh, absolutely. And uh, you guys actually adopted a SaaS model. Talk to us a bit about why you adopted this approach, Greg. Well, 
for us, the SAS model is critical. Um, we wanted to partner with best in breed partners. Um, secondly, we want to leverage their ongoing investment. Um, we're, we're a regional bank um, down here, and so by by partnering with um, others on the SAS model, we can we can leverage their global investment, and it does allow allow us to always um, partner through that open integration framework with um, multiple partners to bring together an ecosystem of partners for an overall proposition. Um, and and as we've moved to the to the SAS environment, it's it's really fundamentally changed our workforce as well. So now we're building out um, best in best in class of, um, people and culture around cloud engineers and, and so forth. So it's almost a quasi tech company operating in financial services and, and turning our way of operating on its head. Very cool. Yeah. And you're actually like a fully cloud native bank. So how does this impact the way that your services are created and consumed? Yeah, again, for us, um, Operating in the cloud is critical. It, it allows us to operate at speed. It allows us to scale for demand. And importantly, we're not now only leveraging this platform for Virgin Money Australia, but we'll be doing so across the Bank of Queensland brands over time. Um, so this is critical. And for us, it's about speed of getting products to market, but also iterating those on an ongoing basis and rapidly deploying um, products. And, 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 and being frank, we couldn't have done that um, previously. Um, when everything was just posted on prem, um, so this is this is a critical capability for us, and obviously it comes back to a lower cost to operate as well, because the more efficient we can be, the better value we can deliver to our customers. Absolutely. Uh, so it sounds like there's some very exciting times ahead. What's next for Virgin Money Australia, and what can customers expect in the future? Well, yeah, no, no rest for the wicked. Uh, phase one <laughs> has been delivered, but um, we're, we're well underway in terms of expanding our proposition out um, to digital home loans, um, uh, expanding product offering in terms of deposits, um, and we're, we're going to be turbocharging our loyalty offering as well. And, and as I mentioned, um, that the success and the momentum of the new technology platform and offering under the, the Virgin Money business means we're now um, scaling that platform to be multi-brand for, for two of the other leading regional banks in Australia, both um, BAQ brand and, and MeBank brand that the BAQ group bought recently. So truly exciting and, and really groundbreaking in terms of Australia. There's very few uh, multi-brand global cloud-based platforms uh, like we've delivered. And so very exciting times. So that's actually a fantastic way to wrap up our Cybos TV session today. Thank you so much for joining us. Phil Finnegan from Temenos and Greg Boyle from Virgin Money Australia. Great. Thank you. Thank you.